I really just like reduced down my makeup to just like a little travel size and then this is basically like all I use now like what's in here like whatever's in here is what I use and this is usually what I travel with or what I take anywhere to go out or anything like this is all I have now like I don't have like a giant makeup bag anymore and I don't wear as much makeup as I used to and I don't like go as ham as I used to I feel like I just do really regular makeup hence my everyday makeup routine I'm gonna list all the products down below um because I'm not gonna probably talk over the makeup it's not gonna be like a step-by-step -step or like a how-to um I'm just gonna be showing you how I do my everyday makeup routine um so I will list everything down below all of the products that I'm gonna use I will list them down below and then you guys can check them out um so you know exactly what I was using. So if you guys want to see the makeup routine that I have been doing for 2020, keep watching. Oh, and I forgot to mention, I already did my skincare before, like, I washed my face, um, and I put moisturizer on, so my face was clean before I started doing the makeup. I always do my makeup standing up <laughs> like I never sit down I don't have like a vanity um I just have like my dresser with my mirror you know what I mean and I don't ever do my makeup sitting down I even in the bathroom like when I go out I do my makeup standing like at a hotel or something like I don't sit down usually Sometimes, yeah, but I hate holding, like, a mirror right here and, like, doing it like this. Uh, I'm weird.
So what are you guys' plans for Thanksgiving? I am going over to my mom's side and we are going to be with her brother, with my uncle. And we're going to have Thanksgiving at his house with all the little kiddos. My, um, so that should be fun. Um. My mom's probably gonna make mole. Well, we're gonna make mole. I'm gonna probably help her make a rice, of a pot of rice, and then um, my sister-in-law and me will probably make um, a dessert and drinks to take. We were looking some up yesterday, and she had her grandma's recipe book, and she found like this really good mac and cheese recipe also. And then she also found like um, a coconut cream pie that she wants. And my mom's making a tres leches cake, which I am so excited for, dude. I haven't had a tres leches cake in a hot minute. So that's gonna be fun and it's gonna be bomb. But yeah, um, we're probably gonna get some. We wanna make like a little like jungle juice for like kids, which is like. Um, just like I think it's like spray and like fruit punch and um some gummies or something like that I don't know it's like a kids drink and then for the adults we'll probably do like um a cranberry cocktail or something something Thanksgiving-y and then um some wine or something but yeah that's what we'll be drinking and then make the desserts and the mole and I think my aunt's making corundas too so it's gonna be bomb but yeah let me know in the comments below what you guys' plans are for Thanksgiving 2020 and yeah I mean there's not much that that we can probably do but I know a lot of people are not getting together because of COVID but I see my uncles all the time. I see my aunts all the time. So I'm like always with them. Or I see them all the time, you know. So I feel like um we're we're good to hang out. I'm not a big highlighter girl like I'm not a big like highlight I did a little bit on my nose like just the nose and then in my eyes I don't ever put anything on those either um but I will put a little bit more spray on for sure for sure put a little bit more spray on because I think I've done pretty much this is basically it Probably for a little console. Thing is, always, always happens, y'all. We all gotta wait. Trick is to wait for the stuff to dry. I'm actually gonna add a little bit more mascara. I'm gonna add a little bit of this one too. I swear I had like three different mascara. I feel like I'm so over fake lashes. I used to be a big fake eyelash girl and I would wear like fake lashes all the time and then um I just kind of stopped wearing fake lashes cuz like they were getting mad annoying <laughs> they were well they were just like they were getting a little bit too much for me and I was just not and I I don't know 
They're freaking uncomfortable. They're super flippin' uncomfortable. I mean, granted, you look bomb as heck. Like, you slay with those on, but, jeez, they're like... They're the most uncomfortable thing ever. And, I don't know. I, I feel like I've been trying to go for that natural flawless look <laughs> and I don't know I feel like I really like this like it looks really natural love the blush and like the lips just super natural like I just use a lip liner like you guys saw I just use that um where's it at this cover girl it's well I'll put it in the description but it's cover girl and it's in the color caramel nude caramel nude however you guys say it but um yeah i feel like this is like what i always go for now so last little spray and i'll be done no pat this down I don't know this actually might be a lot of makeup for some of you like <clears throat> it actually might be like a lot for an everyday thing but um I don't know I just feel like this is something like even if I am doing like I'll probably wear this for Thanksgiving like even if I'm doing like a big thing or like I'm going out somewhere or like it's like um I have a thing to go to or something like this is usually the thing that I go for like the makeup routine I go for so even if it's like a lot of makeup I think it's just like enough to look presentable type thing So this is the final result. This was my everyday makeup routine for 2020. I hope you guys enjoy watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!